<coughs> Hello. Okay, so today is another day, but we're going to be in a slightly different place. We're going to keep moving around this house, trying to find a good place with good lighting and stuff. Um, anybody who's watched us before knows that we're always kind of like moving things around and in different places, but I thought maybe this, this could work a little more long term. Up here would be quieter, possibly. So, I mean, we have to be careful. But... You'd have to be playing online. Yeah, I have to be playing online. No top-down camera here um, with this particular one. But so today, anyway, we're going to be playing on some board game arena. Um, mostly, I'm, I've been trying to get to alpha, but I've been playing, playing, I have not been playing enough board game arena to really get me to alpha um, standard on uh, with them just yet. Um, Mainly because we didn't really realize how much like we really could have been playing a board game arena, and we did not. Um, but we do teach board game arena a ton, but the thing is we don't get through a lot of games all at once. But today we thought we'd start with some Martian Dice because it's simple, it's easy, it's a really fast-paced game. Until we get a few more people in, and that way we can play a little bit more of other things. Okay, we'll switch over... Board Game Arena. Michelle is back. She's going to be here as well playing. She's yeah. just out of shot because there's a very tight area and I have to be careful putting my feet up on I where mean, my tripod is. There is only one chair. <laughs> there is only there's only one chair. It's so. not just like hanging out on the bed. Exactly. Okay. So let's see here. Um, Board Game Arena. Count that up. And um go into games play now okay we'll play some like i said just to start with we're going to do some merchandise and we'll probably do some fruit picking i had a lot of fun with time roller the other day um playing fruit picking and so me and michelle played that later we played a couple rounds of that but maybe we'll wait maybe we'll come in all right here we go merchandise is really simple i actually wish i could get a copy of merchandise in real life yeah. um because well, I think it's a fun one. I think it would work out well for what we do otherwise when we're like playing with larger groups of people. Um, having a couple copies of Martian Dice would be nice uh, for for it. Because one copy of Martian Dice, I think it just goes by so slow. I'm gonna move my head down so we get to kind of see the score. Oh, oh my goodness! What? With. What? Ooh, nice. I am going to go ahead and take people, and I'm going to end my turn. I I'm just going to... That was an amazing gonna roll. take them and run that seven points. Seven points for me. I was teaching this game to a group of people, um, what was it? It was like two weeks ago now? Mm -hmm. It was just really funny because, like, they're all having a hard time understanding just generally what you need to keep. And, um... Gradually they figured it out. Gradually. And, like, as people figured it out, it's like, oh, you can see, they're starting to work it out. Right, right. And then, then you know, the wheel started turning, and, okay, and turn. Well, we got three chickens, and that's good. So, if you look here, the game is so simple. It's just, you're going to roll this big hand of dice. If you get tanks, you got to place them down. They're who you're fighting against. The whole goal is to try to get, try to abduct people chickens and cows if you can get one of each you get a bonus three points otherwise everything is worth a point um but once you've taken them like michelle's already taken a chicken and a cow if you roll them again you can't retake them um the other thing that you can roll is these laser these uh alien guys um and they are who are going to defend they're going to make it so you can actually pick up your chickens you have to have more of these more or the same amount uh as tanks to be able to take a tank. And you have to be able to take a dice every time. You can't take a dice that ends your turn. So there we go. Five points. Boom. Oh my god. Yeah. What kind of thing? You could take cows and just end your turn if you want. Oh. That I'm worked feeling, out. I'm feeling <clears> very. Ooh, I could. I, ooh. That's five points right there. But if you rolled again and you got another cumin. That could go. That could work out pretty I'm well. I'm a bit behind you, so I'm gonna try it. Oh. Okay, I'm still well, good. You are still good. You are still yes. good. Yes. Currently. 
Oh my gosh, so many <clears throat> Wow. Okay, so she just got six, seven, eight points plus an additional three. So boom, up to 18 points Ooh, and one. That was exciting. Shot. Um, yeah, I'm going to end my turn. I'm going to just bank those three. I'm going to let Michelle screw up instead, which she probably won't do. She's better at push your luck games because she doesn't push her luck too much. <laughs> yeah, I guess you're also getting three points as well. Mm -hmm. So it's the first of 25, right? Okay. But I was first player, so you'll get another turn if I get 25. That is true. Okay, I'm going to roll available dice. But this one's definitely, this Pick game cows. is uh, going a lot faster roll available than dice. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and end turn there. I think that should push me over. That's 25. Yeah. Ends okay. it. Okay. <laughs> I like a Rate this BGA adaptation. I've never played the real one. So I'm gonna I'm gonna say it's a perfect adaptation. I have no idea what to base that on. Um, I'm assuming the game has dice and you roll them, so I don't know how to how to say any different. Okay, return to main site. Did you want to do that again? Did you want to play yeah, some poop picking? Just, I thought okay. you were just gonna play some Martian dice uh, again. Hit the uh, like rematch. Oh, right. I should have hit rematch. Yeah. I'll hit rematch next time. Because yeah, I thought we were going to play several games there. Because, <clears throat> you know, we're just trying to up the number of games we played. Right. Because I know how much you want to do alpha. Not uh, not that it really even matters. It doesn't really it, matter. Like, it really doesn't matter, but... Just want to see what other games are kind of, like, showing up. Yeah. You know? Yeah, that, that's that's it. That, that's all. <laughs> um, But seeing everybody else being like, Oh, well, this just came out on... Oh, you've gotten... I pushed it too far. The tanks took you. Could have taken those three points and run. You could have. But I didn't. You should have. I think we've discussed this before. It would be nice to kind of know how many of each face there are. Yeah, I agree. Just so you sort of... There's probably... Let's scroll down. Let's see here. Um, I wonder if it's under how to play. Nope, they don't have any description saying exactly how many of each there are. So. Ah, well, I'm on the board with two points. Yay, two points. I'm going to take one of those, or a bunch of those, I should say. Now we're going to take chicken and a cow. I just need to roll a human. Oh, human. Oh, nice. Perfect. Six points for you. End turn, because I can't take anything else. There's not really a point to, like, roll anymore. We're up to eight. Eight to two. Hello, Mr. Time Roller. How is New Mexico treating ya? We're playing... We're playing the New Mexico-themed game of aliens abducting chickens and cows and people. Um, oh. I was like, oh wait, it's still my turn. Oh, come on, I would need a chicken. No, just got a spaceship. Hmm. Time Roller said, yes well, we are. are far ahead of me. Am I? I'm at 11 points, 11 to 3. You can take some cows. So I'm playing with Michelle right now. We're set up in a little bit different area. Um, but I think this might work. Might be able to live stream a little bit more if I don't have to move as much furniture around to be able to play. <laughs> so, do you like my really quick backdrop? I've got I've got part of Crown and Gloomhaven, and uh, over there somewhere I've dropped a source, and I have a microphone in the shot. So that's that's what my shot I mean, is right now. At least it's an interesting looking microphone. It's not like boring or something. That is true. <laughs> that is true. Um, can I go ahead and turn? It's a nice soothing red. A nice soothing red. <laughs> pro streamer tips. <laughs> Wait, are you saying I'm giving pro streamer tips or or you have some pro streamer tips for me? No, it's not my turn. Oh, it isn't your turn. <laughs> I was like waiting for I'm like for... trying to pick dice. Oh, I think turn. I'm going to take chicken. That seems like a lot of spaceships to take otherwise. I was also going to take the chicken. 
Well, all available dice. Okay, okay, we're good. And ooh, mm. we're gonna take some people. That's a tough one. I'm gonna enter. It's safe. So we're up to twenty one. We're up to twenty one. Okay. Yeah. So we have we have the camera is laying is a, kind of on a mattress, kind of pointing at me. I'm yeah, lit careful. really well by the window, sitting this direction. Yeah. Well, um, you've got your feet on the bed, so you have to be careful not to like bounce the bed. Yeah, I can't. I can't move the. Yeah, gotta be careful. Otherwise, it'll be an earthquake. Earthquake. Um. Actually, no. I think I think this camera has a uh, image stabilization built into it. Well, yeah, but I mean, it can only go so far. <laughs> it can only go so far. <laughs> it can. That is true. Oh, I want those chickens. I need I need some more. No. I got greedy. Too too greedy. All right. Any any suggestions for games today? We were waiting until we had at least three people to play some games. We're thinking short games, possibly. We're thinking fruit picking. Picking fruit. Is that what it's called? Fruit picking? I know fruit picking. Fruit picking? We played it with you the other day. You taught it to us. Uh okay. Less greedy. I mean, you only need four points out of it. I know. But if I just do that, I'm only up to three. Ah. Oh. Okay. So we're going to have to think. I was thinking it might be fun to play kind of a longer game, too. Like... I haven't played Carcassonne in a long time. Michelle's not that big of a fan of Carcassonne anymore. No, I'm so Carcassonne out. Yeah. Have you played? We have not played Tiny Farms. I just saw that and it was like, that looks interesting. But I don't know how to play it. But we could try. We've stumbled through playing things on the stream with, with Time Roller before. So why not? Okay. Well, let's return the main site. We could look at we could look at tiny farms. So I saw that and I thought, hey, we're thinking okay. of building a tiny farm. And so maybe we should learn how to do it through the method of board gaming. Okay, well maybe you could take well, I'm gonna I'm gonna look at it. I was gonna say maybe you could take a look at the rule book it or something. Cause um I need to pull the laundry out of the dryer. Okay. Alright, so more okay, tiny farms. I had the favorites. Okay. Looking at the rule book. This isn't the rule book. This oh I see, I see. The rule book's there. Hey, scrappy kid. Who do you teach? Should we just stumble through it? We could stumble through it. We're thinking of stumbling through playing Tiny Farms. Kinda looks like Yeah. Do you know how to play Time Roller? You can walk us through anything that we get confused on, right? So maybe I will set up. Scrappy, did you want to play Tiny Farms with us? I think you're usually starting up your live stream at the same time, so I'm not sure. And I don't know how long Tiny Farms will last since we'll be learning how to play. I just don't know what I'm Okay. Well, let's go. Play this game now. Um, am I friends with you, Scrappy? Short game. I just realized I may not be friends with Scrappy Kid. Put Time Roller in there. Not friends on BGA, I suppose, would be the better way of phrasing that. So, anyway. So I'll open this door so they're really close to me right now. But it's like, it's like a corner shot. The nice part is, like, like the camera... It's a little blurry, so you can't really make out that there's a vacuum cleaner back there. I mean, now you can. But yeah, there's a vacuum cleaner there and it's sort of like weird section of the house. Okay, so yeah, I'll wait for Michelle to come back up. But what style of game is it? It kind of looked, is it a, uh, a rondel? Is that what it is? That's what it kind of looked like when I was loading it up. Where'd it go? Tiny Farms. Okay, we're gonna do normal mode. Yeah, I'm gonna take off the time limit. Okay, 
interesting to look. It's a Rondell roll and write, but uses picks on here. Okay. Barn wheel. Should we do, let's do original barn wheel. Set to training mode. Okay. Training mode. All right. I set it to training mode, unless if you want to be set to non-training mode. Random. Okay, we did random. Perfect. Now we'll just wait for the shell. Not enough flares. Estimated duration, 3.9 days. That's a long game. I'll tell you. Oh, it's by Dice Hate Me. What else did they make? I know we've had something from Dice Hate Me before. A long time ago, I thought. I can't remember. What are other famous games by Dice Hate Me? Anybody know? Barn mode. Bum bum bum. <laughs> Just waiting. Waiting, waiting. Waiting for the world to change. Brew Crafter. Okay, I haven't played Brew Crafter. Which one? I was trying to think of what else Dice Hate Me makes. Compounded! That's it. That's it. We used to have Compounded. Since Michelle wrote up a, a thing of... Um, chemistry. Chemistry. It was a chemistry unit Pre, study. This is like way back. Pre-website. Pre -pre way back in the day, pre-website, um, we used Compounded. Which one am I supposed to get? Um, the... One in training mode? Okay, you accepted the correct one, it looks like. Okay. Okay. All right. Time roller must pick a die. Perfect. Where are the die? I guess maybe he can see dice and we can't see it. I said it's a rondelle. Um, and it's a I mean, are you roll actually and in ride. The game at the moment, or? Yes. Are you in the game yet? No. There you oh. go. Okay. Weird looking. So this is Tiny Farms. I want to say I've seen this at the store before. So it looks like I have two farms. A red farm and a blue farm. Is that correct? And I'm kind of like gathering. Okay. So Time Roller is writing everything down here. There are two colored meats. Yes. Oh, I see that. Yep. A red and a blue. Okay. And everybody else has a red and blue. And we have a red and blue. Okay. So I'm guessing wherever those lay is going to be where we're going to place. You pick a meeple and a die, and then move that number of pigs. Pips. 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 Completely different thing than pig. Yes. Okay. And then I'm guessing... I'm guessing you're going to get what's in the place of both. Mm. And it'll have to go on that color blue. Right. Speaking of Ron Tals, has any have you guys ever played... Um, my favorite one is, is, is Glenmore. Glenmore it's all, 2. Glenmore 2. It's all packed away I've right never now. heard of a Glenmore 1. Never heard of a Glenmore 1. I've never seen anything by Glenmore I think, 1. I think when we start coming out with games, we'll just label them all as 2. That way people are like, is this your first one? Okay, so Skipping. when you go around, you can be skipping the other meeple too. So I wonder if they have other meeple. Sure, why not? Okay. Miller must move blue. Okay. And it's ten rounds. You're basically gonna get to do ten dice. Okay. You can use your milk to increase or decrease the dice by one. You're gonna get a point for each milk left at the end of the game. Um So you're going to get negative one point per difference in the amount of animals. So you want like an even amount of animals yeah, as you're growing up? Even. Okay. So easiest if you hit the minus magnify to show your farm and be on the same page. Yeah, on the phone I can see both. The farm, the, the rondelle and the... Yeah, I can see both. 
Um, Let's do both. Okay, so here's how it, the scoring is. Move my head up um, here. Um, you get one point per pig, but you get six points per adjacent territory. Sheep have to be in pairs or triplets. Okay. Two points for a pair, 12 for a triplet. Okay. Chickens, you just get two points for chickens. Uh, cows and calves, the number of cows, it looks like the number of cows times the number of calves who are adjacent to each other. A uh, person with the most horses will get 10 points. Second gets six. And then... The forest friends can be across both farms. Okay. We want the same amount of animals in both farms. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Oh, I must pick a die. Pick a die. Okay. Okay. I feel like this one won't be too hard. Maybe it'll work it out. <laughs> I'm going to pick this one. I'm going to move the blue guy one space, I think. Let's collect the sheep. Okay. I want to place him here. And the cow. And I'm going to place him here. Okay. It's probably writing me very important instructions. Ah. Um, pig, sheep, and cows need to be all in one group in each farm. Oh, okay, okay. So, like, as you're placing them, make sure that they're grouped together. So, a few things I think we need to do... Oh, wow. I'm getting really blown out. I'm going to yes. switch this to auto. There we go. That'll be better. Okay. So, a few things I think we're going to have to do... Time roller. We're going to have to set up a Discord... Eventually. That way Tamerler can just come in and talk to us. Here, see, I have a cow with two cows right next to it. Okay. And something, oh, yeah. The whole rondelle just spun and now oh, there's I get different... To, and now I get to go again. Animals. Why Why do I go again, though? You need to go upside down. Well, the whole, the whole farm I, just I spun. I understand that, but I'm just like, what are you doing? I don't know. You uh, did something super special, I guess. That, and another thing, uh, we've been thinking about, Jane has been designing some games, and he needs some people to help kind of playtest them. Time goes on. I'm not sure how we can set it up over stream for him to playtest. None of them yet are rolling right. They're more deck builders. So we'll have to, we'll have to see how we can fit that in. Whew. Okay. After dice are used, I believe the first player moves to the right, which means the last player goes twice each round. Okay, I'm surrounded by cow by cat. But I also only have animals in one farm, so that could come back mm, to me later. I could. But I mean, ah, how do you resist that? I could always build up my other farm later. <laughs> Time roller, I have the sheep button. I'm going to go here. Plants and... Yeah, good luck, Time Roller. I would write it in there, but... Um, I cannot seem to type anything into my phone. Right. So. Oh, and I get to go again. Right. I almost forgot. Okay. So I have a pretty good setup here. Where's the blue? One, two. I'm a little confused because it looks like I can move around the rondelle farther. Is there. Yeah, you can use your mill. Oh. So I to used like one mill last more. time. To be able to reach a little far. Yeah, because okay. as it turns out, you know, the space that the other meat bowl is on does count as a space. Do you... So I use the milk to go one farther. Do you really want to have, like, all the animals, or you just have to make sure that you, you have... You just want to earn whatever points. I mean, like, 
I clearly am going all in on cows. Because it's, it's cow times number of adjacent cats, I think. Okay. Okay. And can I land where another meeple is on? I don't think so. Hmm. Okay. You know what? Let's do this. And I'm going to go ahead and move this one to here. And we're going to place my sheep there and my cow here. And we're going to see how this turns out in the end. And so now hmm. I am at the... So we'll continue to have turn order work. And you don't count other meeples. So I've, it sounds like whoever was first... Last I'm, player is going to be first player is the next one. Yeah, but I can't well, ask you now. You're right. Hmm. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Oh, also, this Wednesday, if you guys are free, yeah. uh, at 6.30 Eastern Time, 5.30 Central Time, and probably 4.30 Time Roller Time, if I have that correct. I think you're only one hour off from us, aren't you? Um, we are going to be playing um, with Leg Up. She is... She used to do board games, and now she just does uh, geo... Um, Geocaching? Geo... Not nah, geocaching. Uh, geo-guessing. Geo -guess She's a geo-guesser. There we go. Anyway, she was wanting to introduce her audience to some board games, and so we're going to play some Trekking the World with them on our channel on Wednesday. Next Wednesday. So we'll still probably do our regular time on Tuesday and Thursday. But next Wednesday will be at night time. So if you're around, coming over. It's 11 a.m. where you are right now. Okay, yeah, so you're just one hour off. It's 12, 12 p.m. here. I wonder what depicts how much this gets spun each time. It's getting spun a lot. Yeah, I think it's just like... I don't know what Time Roller is doing to make it spin so much. Well, if you undo your dice selection, it spins it. But mm. it's going to the same selection. Okay. Because that's what happened to me. I see. He was looking through trying to figure out exactly what is going on. Ugh. Yeah, the, the other meeple space does count as a space I can have the other meeple in. Okay, okay. Yeah, you just said when you undo, when you yeah, undo it resets. Really it's not really spinning. Just pew! I okay, was that's saying... Time rollers part. I'm wondering if it's based on like which number you pick. Oh, the time roller just took a one, right? Because it doesn't re-roll each time, right? Yeah, it's a new round, so there's new dice. And I believe this is a roll and write, so you'd be writing in everything. Mm. But on here, they just do it as like you're placing a token of a cow. Yeah, yeah. A token cow. I kind of like the idea of the token one, better two. than it being a yeah. Um. Okay, what do I want? I think I think I need to balance up my blues. Hmm. Hmm. You know what? I think I'm going to take that. Okay. There we go. I have a whole bunch of cows. Yeah, we'll see if that works out. It might not work out for us. That might have been a, a horrible, horrible plan. Hmm. 
My voice is really weird right now. Just realizing. Oh, why me? What's well, I think for me it's like I can hit lower. So I can tell that's kind of this thing. <clears throat> Picked up a little bit. Okay. Michelle is thinking. Thinking a lot. Oh my god, I shouldn't move around too much. <laughs> okay, so with the chorus animal, we want to have sets of same animal types. Do you want forest animals? Well, so say you have three squirrels, you're going to get eight points. Oh, okay. Yeah, I think I'm, I'm going, um, this is what I do with almost any game when I first play it. Hey, going with the attitude of like, I'm probably going to lose. And losing is okay. Because I'm just essentially trying to understand how the game functions. I want... Camilla is running. He wrote, no, you want different forest animals. Three squirrels gets you one point. Oh, okay, so wait, you want... You want different sets forest... Sets of different types. Of I guess you want a good, healthy habitat. Okay. It's what you're going for there. Where's the laundry? So Just three different forest animals gets you eight points. Okay. Good to know. Um, you want on each of them. Okay. Having a hard time right now. Okay. So I want this one. Like this one. Chicken and a horse or chicken and a pig. Um, I have some milk. I have some milk. I'm gonna take. I'm gonna take this. And I'm gonna go after some sheep. A sheep, and a cow. There we go. Sheep and a cow. I need more sheep over here. There's no spot to get two sheep. I'm realizing. Oh, it's my turn again. Okay. So I need blue. Blue two. Oh, if blue moves two, I can grab a sheep. Put it here. And I could put another. Another cat right here next to a cow. I'm hoping that's the way it's supposed to work. Otherwise, that's going to be like a. I thought I had points. I have no points. We'll see. We'll find out the hard way. Cows and sheep. And you get docked for a difference. I'm feeling like as farmers, we bit off more than we could chew, right? We bought two parcels of land, and we're like, hey, let's fill them in, but let's make sure that we have even amounts of animals on each one. Yeah, but we that's built our farms on like a, a scale, and so if we have too many animals on one side, then it really falls over. Right, exactly, <laughs> exactly. Well, I was thinking of a, like a different, um, on our travels, we met, we met people who were like homesteading. And there was a few people who did similar to this, right? Like they bought some land, and then, and then they bought some other land, like a few minutes drive away. And um, that allowed them to have kind of like a, you know, two different farms going on. But I don't think they were evenly trying to weight the two farms. 
interesting. Okay, one, two, three. Okay, one, two, three. I need, I need another sheep here and a cow. I need, over here, I need a cow. How do I want to do this? One, two, three, back up, back up. four. <laughs> Five. Okay. Well, I, could, I could get a horse. Um, I could do one, two, three, four. I could get a pig. It's a farm game. You know, let's do let's do that one. I'm gonna do four and go here, and I'm gonna get last sale a pig and a cow. There we go. Perfect. So that's set. Tiny. <laughs> I'm tiny. No, 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 he was Grandma. telling you. People get pestered. Okay. A lot. So the other maple space doesn't count if you would land on it. If you would land on it. Okay, okay. But otherwise, you have to count that into the run tile when you're moving around this. Okay, that's, I mean, I guess that's what I noticed with the red. Um. Oh, your turn again. I forgot. kind of funny, I'm realizing that a lot of the games have, yeah, that's better clarification. Hmm. I am not going to have an even amount of animals. No. Where do I go? Oh. I need, okay, that doesn't exist. You don't know where your boxes, you just don't know. Yeah, How's this game? Know. What is it? This is oh. Tiny Farms. I was looking while my friend did a card. Spoilers for new flesh and blood expansion launching in two weeks. Okay. Um, so this is Tiny Farms. We really crazily apparently bought two plots of land. And I'm, I'm thinking maybe we're going through a divorce. And so we're trying to make sure that the land is evenly divided with our belongings between them. I'm not sure the backstory of this. It is the same as... People as tiny town. The backstory is it's boring if you only have one. That's why <laughs> dice hate me. Yeah, dice hate me made it. Okay, so all all I have to do is I have to select one of these two dice, a six or a six, and then I'm gonna move either the red one around one, two, three, four, five, six. So I'm gonna get a pig and a raccoon, and I'd have to put it on the red side of the board. Or if I do the blue, one, two, three, four, five, six. I would get a cow and a bunny and have to put it on the blue side of the farm. Um, and you want kind of an even amount of animals between the two. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do this. We're going to get we're gonna get a bunny, a wilderness animal, and then we're going to put in a cow. Unfortunately, it's not next to a mommy cow in the same way. So I'm not sure if it gets me the same amount of points. I don't 100% understand how the function of the points works. Right now, I'm just trying to keep the groups together. Like, all the cows together, all the sheep together, pigs together, cows together. And I think you it's not bad if I can get one of each forest animal on the board. But I don't know. Do the forest animals... Oh, it's my turn. Do the forest animals have to be placed adjacent to each other? Okay. So the forest animals can kind of... Ah, okay. Across both the farms. Cows are mommy times babies in the same group. Okay, perfect. So it shouldn't matter. Oh. I need some more mommy cows over here. Yeah, because one times... One times that many is not... I have a lot of babies. I have three. Oh, my goodness. I don't have a lot of babies. This is, not, this is not doing so well. I thought I was doing much better. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, so let's see here. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six... One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, I have an even amount between the two farms. So if I move this guy, one, two, three, four. Can I move him three? I could, I could do four, but that's not going to be what I want. Five, six, nope. We're going to go with a, we're going to grab this two, and then we can pay some milk 
to move it a little bit farther because we want to get a mommy cow. Okay, we're going to put the sheep right here, and this says we're going to put the cow here, so I'm going to put the, the other mommy cow. So that's two times four baby cows. I have five times zero on my, let's scroll down the time roller. Yes, time roller has a bunch of, um, what am I thinking? Um, not adolescent, but uh, a, a bunch of baby cows that are not being monitored without chaperones over here, hanging out with a bunny, which is probably a bad influence on them. And then on the blue side, we've got pigs and, and horses and stuff. So I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how this turns out. I'm curious, again, how I play games like this, like just kind of jump into it, play it for fun, and see where we're going. Um, on Saturday, I'm going to be playing with a bunch of possibly random new people to gaming uh, in person. And that's always interesting because I found when playing with people who don't play a lot of games and it's their first time, they tend to get really aggravated if they don't fully understand everything. Um, and so that's, that's the situation I usually find myself in with, with those groups, but it'll be fun. Um, I like pushing people to limits and things. <laughs> One, two, uh, so I would go here. Four, 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 five, six. I could get more of those. I'm going to do that. And we're going to move red to here. And we're going to put in, that's three times three now. Last Maybe round. Maybe the rondelle moves based on which dice is up or down. Maybe. Yeah, we're not sure what represents how that moves. Also, I don't know how, how the game ends. But I think you said it's a certain amount of rounds, right? Like 10 rounds? One, two, three, four. Okay. So we're doing good. Hmm. Okay, we're going to see, yeah. I think, it was I, 10 rounds that way. yes, you play 10 did I win? I won! You won! I got okay, second. I'm going to look at, um, oh, final see. situation, okay, so let's see here, my pigs, can you guys see this? Okay, so let's walk through, yeah, good game, um, my pigs, I had zero, no, I did have one, um, Sure. Oh, here's here's my points. I was looking at the wrong one. One pig. Ow. Twelve sheep. Eighteen. Oh, I had twelve and twelve. Eighteen and sixteen. Perfect. Forest friends, I had one. And remaining milk, I had one. So you get points for milk as well. Okay. All right. Yeah. Hashtag good teacher. Time roller is a good teacher. He can teach you a game through chat. All right, let's do some fruit picking. It's another rundown. Scrappy kid is lurking. He's lurking, but he can still hear. We started working on some of your of your things. I started yeah, drawing out. What do you What do you think of battle axes? Yeah, what do you think of battle axes? <laughs> I, I thought of battle axes was a bad thing. Because we were going through like the raid the raid emotes, and we're like, well, maybe we should do a battle axe. But I, I wasn't sure. So Michelle was like, we should see what he thinks about battle axes. Okay, normal mode, real time, slow speed. Um, your setup, children variant, nope, okay. We'll just do three of us. Start game. Play some fruit picking. Am I, Tisha's falling asleep. Okay. When I call my wife, the old battle axe, she hits me. So it's on point. <laughs> Maybe you shouldn't call her an, a battle axe. Just, you know, might be it might be healthier for you. <laughs> All right, now we're just waiting on Michelle. So fruit picking is another rondelle, kind of like what we just played. Probably best not to. <laughs> yeah. 
All right, and we learned how to play this with, I think I played this with Time Roller on his stream last week. You streamed this last week, didn't you? You streamed this and <laughs> one other game, but I can't remember the other game was that you streamed. But then me and Michelle played this a whole bunch. We played like a handful of rounds, so. Uh, but yeah. And it was fun. It just took some time, like, figuring out what was going on. Okay. Hmm. We are completely symmetrical, though, right? Okay. Yeah. yeah our boards are all the our, same. Our boards are the same. No, I think I'm going to go there. Get some strawberries. Now that I understand a little bit more as to what's going on when I play the game. Be a little bit easier. That's the mirror setup option. Oh! Okay, so like mirror setup, all of us would have slightly different board. All or all boards the same. Okay. I feel like the last time you and I played, our boards weren't the same. So maybe I did select mirror setup. Then we would have like <laughs> mirrored. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six. Three. Yeah, I think I'm gonna do that. No. Yeah, okay, I got my power move all set up. <laughs> Wait, it's a Moncolum mechanic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's a essentially we have our own boards, we're going around and we're taking seeds out. Everywhere we land, uh, we're going to get as many seeds as fruit listed. So if you land on the pineapple, there's only one pineapple. You get one fruit on the pineapple. Um, but if you land on the strawberries, the, there's three strawberries, so you're going to get three. Uh, up top are the cards that you have to buy. And it kind of works like um, victory conditions right here. So you either need uh, like basically a full house, three of one kind, two of another. Um Four of a kind, uh, three sets of two, or one of each kind. Uh, and how what the cost factor is right here. So, like, if you want to buy the strawberry card, it's going to cost you three beans. And the beans have to be on this area. And then you'd have to land on the strawberry to be able to buy. So, let's see here. There's seeds. I, I keep thinking beans because... Same time, the bean is also a seed. But you know. Perfect. Perfect. And now. Oh, now I can't really buy anything. Shoot. What was I thinking? Um. You know what? I could. I could. I go here and I should be able to get the pineapple. So, collect market card. I'll take the pineapple. And I have a whole bunch of seeds. Bananas are herb. Are. Bananas are a herb. Are they? Are you sure about that time roller? That sounds a bit fishy to me. Herb. Yeah, I think they're fish. I agree with Michelle. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you have to fillet them to eat them. Time roller says, I'm sure. Well, I did not know that if that is true. Never really know when Time Roller is trying to pull the wool over our, our eyes, but. Okay, what do I want to do? I also found out the hard way that if you completely run out of seeds on the board, then you basically, you're going to get three seeds placed on these three fruit, and then you pass your turn. And that's, that's all that happens. You know what? We're going to move here. And that's, oh, that's it. Oh, I was thinking, oh, shoot. That's what I was thinking. Two. To rephrase, I was not thinking. Need more seeds. Okay, so far, Time Roller has a strawberry. Michelle has a banana. And I have a pineapple. 
Okay. Bananas are both a fruit and not a fruit. While the banana plant is uh, colloquially, like, I can never pronounce that word. Colloquially, yeah, like regionally called a banana tree, it's actually an herb distantly related to ginger. Since the plant has a succulent tree stem instead of a wood one. Ah, interesting. The more you know. Bum, 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 bum. Are you going to be a turn? Yes. <laughs> um, maybe. We'll do this. That'll reasonably set us up for failure later. One, two, three. <laughs> I need something other than I'm having a hard time. Yeah. <laughs> the uh, <laughs> time roller has uh, animated a moat with the star going up over. It. Oh, nice. Ah, <laughs> uh, thanks. Who 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 made that one? Board uh board DG ten. Nice. That is a great great emote to have. I'm gonna move this. Click here. So every time you land on that little area, you get a bonus turn. So we're gonna do that. We're gonna move the uh, these. Move that. Now we're gonna move two. Perfect. Okay. I have so many seeds. So many seeds built up. In my little area. Board gaming mama. I haven't. I haven't seen any of their. I was I was on someone else's stream the other day. I was just like checking out di different streams. And I can't remember who they were. Um, but they were playing Agricola. And I realized that you have to like. You have to follow them for 24 hours. Before you can like talk. You made a new emote. It's the timer Z's. I saw you play that. Um remember whose channel it was on but like popped up now you can fall asleep reading rules <laughs> oh i see i see i see it now it is a guy falling asleep while reading rules i'm row one z z z yep we have ours and it's just like the our little raid that we have alerts i forgot to like put the alerts on There's ours. We kind of changed all of ours out to be more themed for me and Michelle. Related stuff. Yeah, I like it. Ooh, there's a banana. Ooh, I could do this. And then I could do that. And then I could do this and take a banana. <laughs> Collect market cards. It's the really slow way of getting bananas. Oh, and somebody took the plum. Yeah, that was kind of lame. Okay. Ah, jeez. Um. So yeah, me and Michelle sat down and we're like, hey, we can make emotes. And so I and drew them. Out, we can. Yeah, I drew them up. We were and the then... Josh's. And then after I drew them up, and I was like, oh, look how great these are. And Michelle's like, yeah. And so she took those drawings and made them into better drawings. And then I took her better drawings, and I converted them into digital drawings. Digital drawings. And then colored them. And then I colored them, and then she came back and shaded them. Yes, because I know about lighting. Right. I am. <laughs> I don't know why. I when, them, and I was I'm like, like, where is your light source? You're like, what light source? <laughs> right, and I'm like, it's coming from everywhere because shadows are coming from her. My light source is darkness and it's just coming from every direction. My light source was dark matter. Michelle didn't like that, apparently. Yeah, but I have a harder, I've been having a harder time just like coming up with the initial idea. Right. Like designs. So we need to think, I, I noticed that we have follower emote slots now. So we are going to make um, 
we are going to attempt to make some new ones for there as well. And so maybe we should we, we offered that we'd also make um scrappy kids some emotes as well. So that's what we're trying to also work on right now is figuring out how to make emotes. If that works out well, then we'll start offering to make more emotes because we've just been having fun doing it as a family um, here because it's a, it's a good team effort. Me and Michelle went to school for animation, and this is how we did things. Uh, I just got animated emotes, still need to make them. Yeah. Right, I, because animated I emotes, if you're making them, are a little like different because it's like stacking throwing gift. Confetti in the air. Yeah. Throwing confetti in the air? Right. Or flipping a table. Get everywhere? Or moving a piece, like it's your turn. Yeah. I don't know. Or the more you know. I'm yeah. really liking that I emote. <laughs> Just like. No, I'll have to think through. Because I saw that we had one animated emote, and I was like, oh, now I have to think of an animated emote, too. So. Anyway, we'll play around, and then we'll. And we'll probably offer to do more emotes for our friends on Twitch because they're just fun to do. If you guys if you guys don't mind having cutesy drawings of yourself or something, that's it's okay, kind of our hate, style that we're going. Hate that. It's kind of our our style that we're going for. But we could we can we can create other styles because you've got power. Yeah. Um. Oh, I see. I had actually skipped turn one. I don't have enough. Then we'll go like that. Okay. I was just getting other ones. I'm waiting for the 18th century style emotes. Hmm. We tried. Right, because we were going to... We tried, but it just really didn't come out the right way. Right. Because, like, we have our notebook, and it was just full of, like, oh, we'll try this, or we'll do this. And then we realized, like, the amounts are really small. They are really small. And so it's hard to get, like, when I click on them and I blow them up, like, I can see them a little better. Or sepia tone on parchment. Yeah. Style emotes. Hmm. Yeah, I'll have to think. Because, like, when, when we have the... Because right now we have it set up, you know, if I do a whole bunch of me crying, um, it'll, like, splash against the screen. And then they're bigger, right? So then you can actually see them. But, um, but otherwise you can't really see them that well. So it's that whole strategic thinking. One, two, three, move this one. Actually, I'm going to move this one over one. Here we go. We're probably going to want a strawberry eventually. We'll water the pot. Time roller put up. Notice of raid. And you have Moochie. And Moochie again. And your whoops. And falling asleep while reading the rules. <laughs> and uh, time roller me. What is he saying, though? I think that's the hardest part. Oh, he, he's saying whoops. Because he's Time Roller. <laughs> that's, that's what Time Roller says. Time Roller, you're making yourself a, 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 2D, a 2D character. <laughs> he is saying whoops. Whoops. A two-dimensional character. We'll eventually go visit Time Roller and he'll be like, whoop, whoop, whoop. Whoops, whoops, whoops. And we're like, oh, we didn't understand that. That's all you actually said. Not really. We know that you talk as well. Uh, one, two, three. One, two, three. Okay, I need to get more seeds in my hub. Oh, we're going to do it that way. One, two. I might be able to get one of those. Or. Oh, I can collect them. Oh, right. Ooh. Ooh. It's getting close. This just got real, guys. Not really. I mean, we're just just playing some fruit gathering. Time roller just needs a pineapple. 
Well, it's a good thing I bought that pineapple. Yeah, I guess so. I just need a pineapple now. You opened and you didn't have any pineapple. Yep. Um, what else? So he's going for one of each. I'm not sure what you're going for. I'm now going for. I honestly, I, need, I have no idea what you're going for. <laughs> I need a banana, uh, or a pineapple. I need a banana or a pineapple. I'm set. But I have no seeds in my thing. Time roller doesn't either. He needs to build up some seeds in his hub. Um, I only have one option. Move there. Hmm. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Uh-oh. Oh, there's a pineapple. There's there. a pineapple. It's an expensive pineapple, though. It is very expensive. So to be able to get it, it's going to take a bit of work. One, two, three. A bunch sitting there, then. What would I have? I'd have... Three, four, six, six. Mm, I don't. Ooh, he just made pineapples cheaper. So pineapples require three seeds. I probably should not have bought that one. No. Mm, I don't know. I'm trying to. I'm trying to look ahead into the future. Like, how many rounds is this gonna take me to get? I need one, two, three, four. I do have one. I'll get that there. And one, two. That's not going to get me to what I need. One, two, three, four. And I get an additional two. So then one, two, three. Uh, one, two, three. Okay. So I think what I'm like four turns away from getting that pineapple. Unless well, so somebody buys something else in the meantime. We will see. Oh. What? What'd I you get? Ran, I ran out of beans. Jeez. Oh. Because I put my last one in somewhere else. Right? Yep. Yep, yep, yep. But I mean, I, my second turn was getting beans. Okay, let me move that. One, two. Oh, oh, I'm, I'm stuck. Okay, I could get that, but it's going to um, reduce the price. I, I think it's a bit on the foreboding side that Time Roller has already messaged saying good game. Good game. He's like, I have won this. One, two, three, four, yep. He's going to be taking that pineapple. Hmm. But I could thwart his plan by, you know, I guess I could collect a market card just to have one. It'll make pineapples cheaper. <laughs> he just he just posted an emote of him cheering like, yay! <laughs> oh. Yep, that's so many pineapples. That's the end. <laughs> Still want to get beans. Who's Siha? Do they play board games? It's a Siha hype animated mope and a Siha leave. All right, yeah. this is the last round. Victory conditions have been met. <sighs> I tell ya. Oh. You and I have the same set of patterns. One, one, three. I should be able to get one. All right, so what happens if you get both? I don't know. What well, happens? I just his didn't. Must have his one of a kind, or like one of each kind, must have trumped. Can, can you, kind. Yeah, how does it work? How does the tiebreaker work? So we both got okay. Final situation. So, so I had four of a kind, and he has five. Interesting. I didn't know. I didn't realize that there would be a tiebreaker. I thought it was just like, put mouse on the stop. 
Which star? I think I'm doing the wrong star. Hello, situation. <laughs> that tells you the tiebreaker. In parentheses. Okay. Um, game results. Oh, there we go. There we go. Tiebreaker. Tiebreaker. The number of fruits depicted on the market cards, then the seeds on farm cards. Okay, including Harvest House. The tiebreaker is only for players who complete a set and is not applied to the children's variants. Okay. So he won because he had more seeds on his on his area, I'm guessing. Because I only have a total of one, two, three seeds. And time roller has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven seeds out. He had more seed potential than I did. Okay, okay so we got a message from Lego. That yeah. I, I just had to point out. So, like, you know, we asked, would it work to do Zoom for when we're doing things? She said, oh, well, I could set up a Zoom account so that you can invite me. Oh, okay. So we're two years into the pandemic, and she does, <laughs> she's never been on Zoom. Well, she wouldn't even need a Zoom account. I just need to, like, send her a link. <laughs> I'm going I think it's funny because I've I've done Zoom with so many different people, like doing Zoom game days as more private saying, events, like... and I'll be like, "Hey, like on Zoom, have you guys used that?" And people are like, "Why are you Why are you asking such a dumb question?" But it's because clearly some people just are... don't use Zoom. There's not there's no requirement that everyone had to use Zoom. But you work from home. Exactly, exactly. So yeah, I use Skype for everything. What? Who is... Who still <laughs> uses Skype? <laughs> I didn't even know Skype was still a was thing. Was time roller? It was time roller. Oh, it's probably because time roller's older than me. You're being mean, the poor hey, time hey, roller. It took a while to get my parents to switch over to Zoom. That is true. That is true. I had to download Zoom and go into the uh, Olympian show. <coughs> oh, to go into the Olympian show. Yeah. All right. Do you want to try... Um... Do you have another game you want to try? Yeah, so the other day when we were doing work games, we were going to try... Um, oh yeah, what was the other work game? Oh, what was that game called? <laughs> Skype just sounds better. I mean, it is true. We we use it as a verb, right? Hey, do you want to Skype on Zoom? On Zoom, yeah. <laughs> we can Skype in a little bit on Facebook Messenger. <laughs> it's like Coke in the South, right? Did you want to... What kind of Coke would you like? Would you like a Sprite Coke? Haiku. It was Haiku. Is what it was called. Haiku. I don't know how to play Haiku. Discord sounds like you're in a tin can, and Zoom works, but it's low quality. Haiku is fun. Okay, we're going to try Haiku. Do I have Haiku saved? I don't know. Okay, let's try out Haiku. So in Haiku, you are there's like going to be words out, and you have to play out a word, or uh, I think two word cards. To help people figure out what your clue is. Or like which which word is your word. How do you spell haiku? H-A-I. Ah, there we go. There we go. Got it. Add to favorites. Let's play this game now. Bum, bum, bum. Ba -da -dum, bum. Okay. Okay. So it said, above your faves... You have display option, and you can put them in alpha order. Oh! Oh, that's cool. I should change it to alphabetical order. <laughs> okay. Um, comma mode. Yeah, we want normal mode so it counts as playing a game, right? I'll just do normal mode, no time limit. Um, yeah. Looks good. We'll figure out how to play it on the fly. Pretty much. Yeah. What did it say? There we go. I have to hide your screen. Okay. Peekaboo. Your secret clues have arrows above them. Okay. So. Hmm. 
I'll put I'll put my face over it once it loads up too. You pick words to give us as clue your secret word. Mine still shows that we're waiting for time alert too. Okay. I think. Oh, it's loading. Yeah, mine just went back to the other screen. There we go. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna just pop that over for now. Unless the timer layer keeps it. Okay, so build your clue by choosing a word and then clicking on the plus sign. You must make a clue. So I'm trying to get you guys to guess the shape, right? Like the, the word underneath the shape. Am uh -huh. I correct? Okay. Because yeah. there's an arrow pointing at a particular shape. Um, okay. Um, and I only get to choose one word. Right? Mm -hmm. Clue. Okay. We need to guess the word. The shape is just, uh, a shape is just a placeholder. We need to guess the word. Okay. Um, okay. We may have the same word, right? Um, okay. Ah, okay, I selected a word, but now what? Then click on Build your clue sign. by choosing a word, then that. clicking on a plus sign. There we go. What did you do? You can. I clicked on a plus sign and then added my second clue because you need to do two words. Okay. Okay. Submit clue. Okay. And then now, oh, I can. Okay, so time roller then gave me a clue, and I'm guessing I have to look at this. And then pick which one you think time roller has. Okay. Well, that's what mine is. Right. Okay. Oh, and now it's my clue. Okay. And now you guys have to guess which one. I see. Hmm. Okay. I mean, it seems pretty straightforward. Yeah, I liked my clue. Grow, repeat. Grow, repeat. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay. I'm going to just... There we go. My... My... Oh, okay. I see. Let me make this slightly bigger. There we go. Okay. I'm now covering up the screen. Now no one can see... On Twitch, what we're even doing. <laughs> hmm. Okay. This is a hard one. Okay, I think, I think I'm good. And he said we could we could technically have the same clue. Yeah. Okay. Other players must make a clue. Well, I'm not as pumped about my clue this time, but it's yeah, still, it's still okay. I think I, I hope it'll work out. Well, I understand this now because, like, when I was teaching, ah, uh, the one. The first group in French, uh -huh. um, they were looking for games to help people learn language. And they're like, oh, there's Hey Clue on here. But them, since they were had their settings. Hey Clue. Yeah. Since their settings were set to French, they were able to see these as French words. Oh, okay. And so they played a ton of this game. Oh, wait. Oh. Five clues? I didn't know we could do more than two. 
Okay. Okay. Uh, I, mm, I'm not really sure on that um, one. Okay. Wait, what was it? Who got it? I don't think either of us did. I think it was Cookie. I think it was Cookie. Yeah, I did that because bad clue words and to clarify. Yeah. (laughs) Cookie. (laughs) Yep. Okay, so there's mine. Bum, bum, bum. Yeah, I could see this as a good practicing language. Type. Yeah. It'd be hard type though. of game. I had better clues. Do we all have the same clues or we all have a mix of different clues? No, we definitely have a, di- a mix of different okay. clues. Okay. Because I did not have any of the ones you guys did. Okay. didn't have very good options for <laughs> clues, if I'm honest. It was not a good one. Oh, you were cookie as well. Everybody I mean, was cookie. Everyone was cookie. Yeah. Everyone was cookie. I had raw and round, and that was, like, perfect. I thought, you know, smart cookie. Oh, uh, okay. Cookie mix. Okay. Hmm. Let's see here. Oh my word. Right. <laughs> you know, I feel like that first round was just super easy. <laughs> oh, wait, wait. Click plus sign. Submit clue. I was thinking of using more than one, and I was like, ah. If I give more clues, it's not necessarily. Okay, I'm just, I'll do that. Get a good clue. Word is easy. Right. Okay, uh, time roller. Face frame, tense, repeat. Okay, I'm, oh. All right, what did you guess? You guessed trick, I guess. I guessed trick. Search. You guessed search. I got search. it. Yeah. You got it. Okay. Rally Bell. Yeah. Did they blow up the house? Uh, they didn't blow up. Oh. Somebody else did. I thought I had a banner here. Hey, what was your word, Adam? I didn't see what it was. Oh, um, my word was search. Oh. Oh, good. This was bound. Uh, yep. I got it. Nice. What will we play to? I'm not sure. Mm. With a three to five player game, it's six rounds. All right. Well, I'll just show my thing that way. Anybody is as long as time roller's not looking. Hmm. <sighs> Actually, I wonder. I just do yes. Do that way. Okay. But he has the stream uh, screen scrolled up so you can only see the chat. 
Well, okay. that's good. Okay. Hmm. Who who is the codemaster giving us these like <laughs> clues? Okay. No, oh, well maybe I'll do that. And um that we'll submit that clue that is i'm not sure we'll see we'll see how this turned out Ooh, wow okay time roller just gave us the entire clue pile smart offer royal dope mile sharp killer i think he's we're supposed to read it in that order smart offer so probably not Maybe a log. Study, smart, offer, royal, dope, maybe. Maybe somebody who studied. Miles, sharp, killer. Or chief. I don't know why. I feel drawn to chief. Oh, clues next to each other are supposed to be combined. So smart offer, royal, dope. Mile Sharp Killer. Uh, I don't know. Oh, a shoe. A shoe. Me and Michelle both guessed Chief. <laughs> okay, okay. So I see now. So, like, next time. And the shoe is Flesh Boy. Yep. <laughs> I'm realizing, I'm realizing now where you add things. Like, you don't, you don't just necessarily go add, add. So he was saying if you go add, add, like, they're supposed to be kind of read together. So add, add is, like, different. So maybe instead of bowling splash. <laughs> I meant something else. Group. Tour. Okay, good. It was it was studied. Bum bum bum. If you have the real like the IRL version of this game, what depicts which clue you get? You need to look at Del Valley. Oh oh oh! I like, think you would probably just get a card. Okay. So it shows which color you get. Okay. You must make a clue. Okay. Okay, maybe. You put four words out under, and each person has four cards for four shapes. You draw one of them and get a random shape that corresponds to the word. Then when what? voting, what? you put yeah. out the shape you are yeah. voting. Oh, okay, yeah. I see. All at the same time, I'm assuming, and then like flip over so that way people can't change their mind. The blind vote. I don't know why it's so hard to like teach people that. Like, okay, on the count of three, you're all gonna show what you have. Like, we have ink and, and it's gold. Always like, oh, I forgot. I, I meant show. Right, 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 right. Ink and gold that happens all the time because people are like, one, two, three, are you in or out? And they're like, I'm. I mean, I mean, I'm, I'm still in. 
Or no, no, no. I meant I'm out. I meant that's what I meant. I noticed that everybody else was gonna be in. I want to be out. <laughs> well, like all at the same time. Stop changing your turn. Oh, okay. I'm gonna choose this. Jeep mate. Alien temple. Okay. Ah. Oh, branch? Branch. Branch seems correct. Michelle got that one. Yeah. I did leading. <laughs> I gotta get better at clues, guys. <laughs> You put your guest face down and all flip at the same time. I'm glad I gave you guys so much to work with here. Yeah, that's tough. <laughs> you guys are like, well, I know what this... I know what the answer of this one is. What was it? It was leading. Oh. What did you do? Tag. Tag. Page out. A tag. Tiny, handy, urgent. Hmm. It was tag? Mm-hmm. It's tiny. It's handy. Sometimes the tag can be urgent, I guess. Sometimes you, you decided. I decided. <laughs> okay. It's also hard because you're looking at the other words that are up there, right? And you're like, Ugh. I can't put this because then they're going to guess the other thing. Hmm. I think I think I'll just do that. I don't want to submit the clue. I kind of wanted to add like one or two more to that, but I just felt like it would get a little too confusing. And I feel like I had okay clues this time. Maybe. Uh oh. Can you get me? Oh, I never plug in my computer. Uh oh. Ah! Oh, sorry. Sorry. <laughs> There we go. There we go. I knew I forgot something. Oh, now put the computer back on my lap. There we go. It's funny hearing you read the clues. They don't sound as good as they <laughs> seem in my head. Like, raw stone, hollow ground, giant. It's hollow round. Hollow round. That's completely different. Hollow round. Hmm. I don't feel like it could be an album, because I don't know of any raw stone album. Well, uh, hollow, round, maybe it could be an album. I don't think it's dozen, so I think of eggs, and I don't think it's a pet, unless if you have a pet stone and a giant pet. No, I'm going to go with tower. I did too. It was tower. Yay! Okay. I believe. And that kind of cool. I'm just sitting and waiting. Like, yeah. <laughs> guess my clue. Guess that. It's okay, both of you like guessed it. Right <laughs> now you guys just have to guess mine. Flesh, oxygen, shake, passing. Okay. Like. <laughs> I don't think it's a tower. 
The tower doesn't have as much flesh in it. I mean... <laughs> And it'd be really weird to have, like, a flesh album. I'm gonna go with pet? But what are you doing with your pet? Shake? Pass it? Give it oxygen. At least you did no. something. Hey, right? our pet passed the summer. Oh, okay. All right, Michelle won 14, 13, 11. That wasn't too bad. You're a pretty princess. <laughs> We all matched that last round. Yeah, we all got it. Okay. Alright. Uh, return to main site. Any other short games that we haven't tried yet that we were thinking of trying or playing? Oh, display options. Short by name. There we go. So now I'll be able to find things faster. Um, Luster, but we have to learn how to play that one. We could do the builders. No, that's not that short. No, that sounds terribly short. Um, hmm. Oh, hey, we were talking about doing Can't Stop. Do I have a Can't Stop on here? Yeah, I have Can't Stop. Okay, we'll do we'll do a round of Can't Stop. Can't stop regular. Normal mode. Play if you want. Don't play if you choose not to. You know. You know how it goes. Find a way to like play a bunch more games. I still... I Something that I find interesting is a lot of the people we have taught how to play games on here have played a lot more games than we have on here. Yeah. Like, like the DeClays have played like 1,800 games. I don't know how that's wow, possible. Like, what are they doing? But I think, I think it's because... I mean, honestly, we almost used Fortune Marina exclusively Mother for our live stream. Or for work. So we don't play it that much to, to play it. Right, that is true. That is true. Because if we're going to play a game, we usually just play an actual game. Right. We do have that benefit of we Unless just like we just set up a set up a game play. I had tried I had tried learning the the Route sixty six, um, but I was trying to figure it out. I was having a hard time with how they actually move. And so, I was, so I was playing in training mode, I think, by myself. Um, but yeah, we could try that out at some point. So oh, I have to choose a combination. My turn first. Okay. Um. You know what? We're gonna do that. We're gonna continue. We're gonna do that. We're gonna continue. Um. And I think I'm gonna stop. There we go. We are super climbing now. It's weird. They move left to right, up and down diagonal. Okay, because that's what I, I was. I was. I think I was playing the tutorial for it, and I was like, I'm not understanding. But I was. I think I was trying it on the phone, so I couldn't really see what was happening. And I was like, Oh, I'll put it on the back burner. I'll try that when I have a computer again because it's a little easier with a computer to play. Ladies. So Time Roller, what kind of video sharing software do you like to use when you like co-op stream with other people, like multi-stream? Because so far we've only used, I've only used Zoom and I've used Facebook, um, like started up like a Facebook room like messenger room and I've done that and then pulled pulled people's like video and audio from either one of those I pulled it from from that I've I've only used much. discord on stream so like I think that's the thing is like discord I've never 
Yeah. I haven't enjoyed the audio, like you had already mentioned. Um, and so, I didn't, uh, I'm not sure about that. That's on six. Is that on two? Where am I? Two and nine. I could do that. And, you know what? Let's continue. No. Ah, uh, I should have stopped. Skype is hard because it mirrors the screen. Yeah. Um, I've had issues with setting up Skype before. Just getting getting everybody on in on a call. The Zoom, I'm just more familiar with because that's what I do the the conferences on, and that's um, and that's what I've been able to do like the the board game Zoom game days on. But a lot of times I haven't, I haven't live streamed from there, because again the, the you know visual quality can't isn't always the best. But I think we've used it because um, user friendliness. It's a little easier to just throw people in. What color am I? Am I red? I'm green. I should look up here. I'm red. Okay, so. Well, in that case, progress on six and five. I don't have anything started there. We'll do three and eight. Okay, continue. Oh, let's just do a four and four, and let's stop. We're gonna get safely to the top of that mountain. We have a new Skype groups and it's like Zoom. You just send a link and they log in even without Skype. Okay. So maybe I have to play around with more. It's hard when there's like just so many options. So many different visual video related options. Okay, there's something. I'm very sorry. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, where am I? Oh, let's progress on the end. Okay. Well, we haven't gotten very far. Let's progress on the end. And let's progress again. And let's stop. <laughs> there we go. I was watching someone play the other Can't Stop Express. I think we even looked into it once, didn't we? We, me, and you tried it in training mode. Can't stop. No, it. I don't think we did. The the new new one. It's like a roll and write or something. Oh, yeah. Like version of it. But I don't think we liked it as much. It was a little, it was less clear oh, to yeah, yeah, follow right. what was going on. No, that one wasn't at all fun. So. Like, it just felt like bookkeeping. Right. Like, there wasn't anything to keep your interest. OBS Ninja is good for capturing others' webcam, but it doesn't capture audio. Oh. Really? Okay. I guess I didn't know that, because, um... Someone had messaged about, you know, doing OBS Ninja, but I've never tried. Again, there's just so many to choose from, so part of it is just keeping, I don't know. Our philosophy is the whole KISS philosophy, KISS philosophy of keep it simple, stupid. And right now it's like, well, we know how to run Zoom, and we can just send you a Zoom link. You can come in. Boom, we'll just, we'll just screen capture the Zoom, and we know where our audio is on the yeah. same setup. And if we take audio from Zoom and allow Zoom to have the um, the other audio, it is, then it can work. So let's choose. Mm, what do I want to do? Seven and seven. No, it's kind of not going after seven. Let's do six and eight. No, let's do the three and eleven. Um, 
four. I'm the only one going up four, so might as well. Going up eleven. Continue. Oh, I didn't actually didn't mean continue, I meant stop, but this works. Three stop. There we go. Okie dokie. I prefer Can't Stop Express. It's difficult if you don't understand what's going on. It's very thematic. Very thematic. So, he said he likes Express. If you don't understand that in Can't Stop, you can only go up three tracks on your turn. You understand. Uh, you understand press a lot more. Okay. Can't Stop Express. Express. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got gotcha. you. So it's hard, like, you know, chat typing what you're trying to say, because then you're like, "That's not what I meant. I didn't mean. I meant. I meant. I meant this, not that." I'm not doing all the same. Hmm. Mm hmm. Hmm. We'll take that one. Okay. Continue. I remember when we played with my mom, she like she would roll once and she would stop. Like like you can, you can roll a couple times. Like mm -hmm. like you could roll at least until all three of your tokens are out. Right, mm -hmm. right. My keyboard is bad on my laptop. Yeah. I get. I'm like, oh, this, and then you know, it's hard because it's like talking in a delay, right? My fingers don't type at the same speed. So one hand gets ahead of the other. <laughs> yeah. Mm, time roller is chancing it. He's going to take that like seven. Or four is he going to do it? Oh, he did it! And he stopped. So time roller, I think, just took seven. Oh, no, he didn't. Mm. Unable to continue. Loses any progress made this turn. Dog. Oh wow. He's regressing quickly on that one. Mm. <laughs> <sighs> I'm kind of excited next week. This is live stream on Wednesday. It'll be the first time I'm doing it at nighttime in a long, long time. Yeah. Well, it's going to interfere with bedtime. That's part of the reason. Yeah, that is true. Continue. 7 and 10, 7 and 10, or 10 and 7. Well, I guess that's what I'm taking. You know what? I'll just stop there. At least I have some on those lines now. We'll see. Hmm. Just gonna see who's currently live streaming so after this strawberry void dutch yoga trip camp book of nerds things like that oh time roller got the seven it looks like yeah. i jump on any chance to play games on your stream because y'all are fun meeples and i enjoy the time I spend around you. Well, thanks, Aww. Time Roller. Well, we like playing with you, too. Yeah. Hopefully at some point here we can get, like, an in-person play. Right, right. But it, it might be a bit, you know? It might be a little while. That said, though, we are looking for properties around Branson area, like south southwest Missouri. So that puts us a lot closer to you than we are currently up here in Minnesota, so 
Um, I think that just puts you at like 900 miles away instead of 2,000 miles away. I'm not sure. I haven't, I haven't done the critical math to figure that out yet. Ooh. Do that one. We're going to continue. That's good. Continue. Oh, it also has five. I have nothing really going on six, so let's take the five. And then I'm going to stop. Hey, Duchess. Hi. Time Miller said, I haven't had or needed a vehicle since COVID started, so that has limited my travels. Yeah, that'll do it. And Duchess said, I'm working, but wanted to say hi. <laughs> well, I'm glad you said hi. We're glad you said hi, too. Do you have a new batch of puppies coming out? Puppies? <laughs> <laughs> we still hear about the missed puppies. We still hear about the missed puppies. I'm from. Sad. I'm sad. Why are you sad? I miss the puppies. I miss the puppies at Duchess's house. Because I have puppy muffins. <laughs> Can I please have puppy muffins? Can I get your daddy one? Puppy muffins! Puppy muffins! There's your puppy muffins. <laughs> I have one puppy right now. We'll have another litter in spring. Okay. So, Duchess, you have to make a game all about puppy farming. Ooh, and it's like, it's like you have to, you have to get the puppies. You have to have the puppies, but you also have to have people to take the puppies before they turn into dogs. Because nobody wants a dog. They just want the puppies. Well, there's got to be some resource management. Yeah, resource and management. And, of course, poop and pee cleanup. Yes. Poop and pee cleanup. And and we have to account for lost flip flops because the flip flops are going right, down. right? Definitely lost flip flops. That's a huge expense. That is a huge expense. <laughs> um, I don't know what it is about that kind of foam sort of stuff. Tucker loved chewing. Yeah, Tucker stuff. loved it too. Puppies are a wonderful thing. Tamara says, I have three kitties Aww. that are not puppies, but I guess they can be cute sometimes <laughs> when they allow it. We had, we had so many like weird animals on our travels. Like we had Duchess's puppies. Uh, we had the cows, the Highland cows that the boys tamed. The Highland cows were fun. And we had the, the farm cats. That were on on the campground. Uh, the campground we stayed at had a mm -hmm. had two cats. And there was the one place with the llamas. Oh yeah, the the llamas. And the one that place good with too. the Angora goat. Angora goat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Griffin with liked long, the Angora like, goats because hair. they had peanuts for you to feed them. Oh yeah, they liked that. That's fun. More fun on a board than in real life. <laughs> Some days. Yeah, probably. My best friend bought a shoe-shaped dog toy <gasps> for her, her dog, feet. and her dog started eating her shoes. She didn't connect the two. Ah. That tells you. Yeah, so if Duchess, if you're still there, like... I think, I don't know if we should, we're going to be looking for a property to hunker down, probably somewhere in Missouri, be our midway point, and then we're going to have to build out a property most likely. So a tiny home on the property. Ugh! I guess I'll stop there. Oh, did I cut you off? Yes, you did. <laughs> you knew you did. Tell us so many. Oh, I feel bad about it. Oh, I had no possible move. I'm gonna eat move. a truffle now to reward myself for cutting off. 
She's gonna eat chocolate to reward herself for being okay. mean. We need to get more truffles. We're we're out of truffles. <laughs> no. I will only take the four. I have one. I have one line. That's all I have. I just realized if I stop there, I'll win. <laughs> Dust said she'll be praying for us that everything lines up for us in Missouri. Much oh. more mild winters. I know. Yeah. But warmer summers. Oh, so warmer summers. We're, we're thinking of building an A-frame cabin, tiny home. That way we can, we can kind of position the A-frame to be at the right angle for solar panels on the top. Because we found the solar panels really helped shade the trailer and it kept it cooler. So we're thinking that might help shade it in the uh, in the summer to keep it cooler. Mm -hmm. True. So that's the plan. But then the other side of the roof would always be in the shade. If one side is always mm -hmm. facing south, the other side is always facing north. Um, that's kind of the kind of the plan. We'll see what actually comes to fruition. I would not uh, an award. You get a new trophy. Fast Sprinter. 10 games played in 24 hours. Ooh, nice. Nice. Okay. Well, it's 1.30. Running on snack time. Yep. So, we'll probably end the stream here. And go back to here. So, what did you guys think of the new office -y setup? You have board games behind us. Ha, and, a, and a microphone and... And we can set this up a lot easier. Less, well, like I said, less furniture moving around. Um, the only thing is we can't do top down uh, here because I have no table. I'm on Nivo Grande. Gave us a, uh, a little lap desk. And so that's what I'm using. Harder to see the wife. It is because she is way, way over there on the other side of the room. But she was like, I don't have to be in the shot. I can sit off to the side. So... She likes to just throw me in front, I guess. But, but then when we have Jane back, we're going to probably play some downstairs as well. Because like I said, on Tuesdays, we'll play our top down of some sort of game. Maybe start going over some of Jane's games that he's been inventing. So maybe sometimes we all can switch. Yeah, yeah. Maybe sometimes we can switch. Yeah, I thought so. It's... <laughs> It's, I was like, I'm going to be in a corner with a bookshelf. It's going to be board game masterpiece theater. Um, but anyway, it worked out for, for this quick set. Once we get to Missouri, we're going to be back on cell phone data. And so we'll have to see what that kind of looks like. But we've thought about live streaming part of the build and the land clearing. So it'll be better, less board game related. Unless if while we're doing the land clearing... We like cut them down to dimensional lumber and make board games out of the wood from the property. Hmm. Hmm. That's an interesting thought. Okay. Well, let's see here. Let's see who is around. We will send y'all off to Ah, uh, Scrappy's there. I think he he raided us last week, so we'll just we'll go back over to Scrappy. Hey. Scrappy kid. And I can also type this in because I know how to how to write it. But anyway, we'll see you guys here next Tuesday. And then Wednesday night, we're going to be live with uh, Leg Up. And we're going to be playing some Trekking the World, right? Yeah. Yes, Trekking the World. We're going to have to review how to play that game. But we're going to play Trekking the World. Good choice. I'd love to see you all. Yeah. So that's that's the hope. So you'll see us building, but it'll just more be highlights. It'll be like, today we're doing this. Because otherwise, I think it'd be really boring to watch us for like four hours chopping down trees and stuff. So, <laughs> but we'll see. We'll see. Maybe you guys would like that. I don't know. I don't know. We'll see what we can set up on, on property. So, otherwise, have a really great weekend. See you guys later. Um, and we should, we should play more times. So it'll all come together and play some games. Um... So it'll be our first time doing it with Leg Up, playing games with her, um, and having her on the stream. But after that, maybe we can have Time Roller on, or Duchess on, we can play some games together. Alright, have a good weekend. Bye!